Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm Noah from TechnoBuffalo.com. And you know, you don't have to be rich to use a smartphone these days. In fact, with Metro PCS, you can get unlimited talk, text, and web for less than $42 a month. I know. I, should have been, uh, I shouldn't have been lazy. I should have walked to the rich and 40th corner. But it's kind of a weird intersection here and whatever. Anyway, it's true though. You know, all these uh, these contracts with the big four carriers and stuff, and you're paying $70, $80 or more a month for your smartphone service. Metro PCS is all like, no, wireless for all, baby. This is the new LG Connect 4G. You gotta pay a little bit more up front. It's $349, $30 rebate. So it's $319 direct from Metro PCS after rebate with free shipping. But you can get service for as little as $40 a month unlimited talk text and web you can go up to sixty dollars a month for the unlimited everything with uh, all the the unlimited multimedia streaming they'll call it it's kind of like throttling data cap we'll get to that in a second but the thing is what do you get for your 319 and your less than forty two dollars a month is it worth it there's only one way to find out alright so just as an aside I happen to be near a church here on the corner of Rich and 42nd, and this is an awesome sign. Uh, I'm, I'm not, this is not a pro or against, you know, Bible study. I just like that they say we offer free technical support every Sunday at 10 a.m. That, folks, is marketing. All right, so here it is, wireless for all, the LG Connect 4G, just out from Metro PCS. It's an Android phone, obviously made by LG. Um, you're not going to get the latest version of Android, it's going to run gingerbread, but what you get here is you get a 4-inch display that we might have to take out of the direct sunlight here for you to really see. 4-inch display, you've got a dual-core processor, 1.2 gigahertz dual-core, it's Metro PCS's first dual-core. Uh, it's LTE compatible, although Metro PCS's LTE speeds are not in the range of Verizon and AT&T. You're going to get more like 3G, maybe WiMAX speed. Uh, it's got dual cameras, you've got a 5 megapixel camera on the back with 720p video capture. And then you've got a front-facing camera for your um, video chat type needs. Uh, also up on top here, you've got a headphone jack. There's your power switch on the side, rocker switch, micro uh, USB port. On the bottom, not much to see there. On the other side, not much to see there. On the front, you've got four capacitive touch buttons, your standard Android layout. Uh, the phone itself, you know, it's, a, it, it's not the slimmest, not the lightest phone out there for sure. Uh, but it feels pretty solid in the hand. Let's and get this out of the direct sunlight because, you know, it's not really fair to uh, to pit this phone, you know, against the competition in the direct sunlight because uh, not really anything compares, <laughs> does all the well in the direct sunlight. Let's get out of the direct sunlight here. All right, so also in the box you get your manuals. You get a uh, travel adapter, your AC power adapter, and your USB cable. So pretty standard stuff. Bring your own headphones, that kind of thing. Uh, but again, looking at the specs here, you've got 720... Uh, 720p HD recording, 1.22 gigahertz dual core processor we talked about, a full gig of RAM, uh, the LG Nova display uh, with Gorilla Glass, Gorilla Glass on it, which is good, Dolby Mobile, uh, you know, kind of all the standard stuff, and a 2 gigabyte micro SD card pre-installed. All right, a little bit easier to see now out of the direct sunlight in the car. Just moving all around. It's man on the street style here. Uh, but, you know, this is wireless for the people, right? So man on the street makes sense. Anyway, uh, the display, uh, four-inch, um, it's a four-inch Nova display, LG's display. So, you know, not in the not in the range of the super top of the line, uh, super LCD 2 and super AMOLED and all that stuff, but not a bad display. Uh, full gig of RAM inside here. It comes uh, preloaded with a two gigabyte micro SD card as well, so if you really want to load this thing up with storage space, you're going to have to bring your own card to the party. Uh, but otherwise, you know, you've got Android going on, like we said, uh, the LG skin on here a little bit. Uh, let's go to settings. I mean, not a little bit, it's the LG skin, it's just not a super heavy duty skin. Uh, I'll go to settings here, go to about phone and confirm. We're running 2.3.6. And you can see right now, I'm in uh, I'm in EVDO, I'm in EVDO land, I'm not in the LTE land, so we're going to have to find some LTE compatibility, uh, LTE service area to test out the LTE speeds. But like I said, uh, Metro PCS people are reporting more in the range of, you know, maybe one to four megs down, that kind of thing. So more like 3G or even Sprint WiMAX speeds, not the super fast speeds people are getting from uh, AT&T and Verizon. Uh, but looking at the phone, comes with a bunch of stuff pre-installed. 
uh, you've got the Rhapsody application. So with Metro PCS for $60 a month, you can get uh, full unlimited everything, including the LTE support and including unlimited Rhapsody streaming. So, you know, you're looking at comparison that'll cost you $10 a month on its own. So you're looking at what, 50 bucks a month for the service. If you want to look at it that way, which still is a, a good deal, much less than what you would pay on um, Sprint or Verizon or what have you. Let's go to the camera. We'll take a picture because it'll last longer. Why do I like saying that so much? I don't know. Uh, here, we'll take a picture of the uh, fake leather dash in the car here. And so your camera options, you know, we can switch to the video mode, go back here to settings, and get your full HD 720p, all that good stuff. If we go back to, uh, we'll go to front facing. And if we go front facing now, can we capture video in front facing? Yeah, VGA. And then, if, hi everybody. Hey everybody, how you doing? And then if we turn it around to camera mode, VGA um, as well. And we'll go back and flip. And so the camera itself, the main camera, You got your uh, up to five megapixels there. Let's get rid of that. I think what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to uh, customize this phone and see, you know, if I put, um, if I get this hooked up as just a stock Android device and set it up the way I want it and get rid of, you know, some of the bloatware stuff and then put on some of my own stuff that, um, you know, customize launch or all that kind of thing. I'm really curious to see if I could live with a phone like this because. When you're looking at, you know, something like 40 even $50 a month as opposed to, you know, up around 80 uh, for something like an iPhone with unlimited messaging, that kind of stuff, you know, that's, all, that, that's, that's roughly half price, uh, depending on which level, a little bit more than half price, but still you're looking at, what, 30 40% off, and over the course of two years, that's going to add up to, let's say it's $30 cheaper a month. You know, times 12 months for a year is 360 times two years, $720, which, uh, you know, th that's that's nothing to sneeze at um, unless you live at the corner of rich and rich. So definitely something worth checking out. Uh, and that's what I'm going to do. You know, I'm kind of thumbing through here, but it's pretty, pretty standard stuff. Can I go to Rhapsody? I have to get the app. Yeah. All right, whatever. This is the stuff you have to deal with when, uh, you know, you buy a, um, well, I mean, you buy a high-end phone from anybody these days, pretty much unless it's a, a Nexus or an iPhone, uh, and you're going to get bloatware on there. You buy a uh, mid-range phone on the cheap from Metro PCS, you got more bloatware to deal with. But look, I can just get rid of it. Yay. All right. I'm going to get connected. It's the Connect 4G from LG and Metro PCS. Thanks to the folks at Metro PCS for sending this to me. And I'm still, I'm excited, honestly, to check this thing out. Because it's really, you know, the phones these days are, um, the spec sheets, I mean, dual cores and quad cores and all that race to the top and everything. But, you know, unless you're playing, like, wireless gaming, how much of that can you really take advantage? I don't know. But one thing on the spec sheet everybody can relate to is the price tag. So that's what I'm investigating, spec sheet-wise. We'll have much, much more on the LG Connect 4G, and the power of Metro PCS LTE network, or the lack thereof, over on technobuffalo.com. Till next time, I'm going to get out of the car and edit this video. I'm Noah. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.